So Gary, uh, 0-0 at home to Northwood tonight. Just talk us through the game. Um, well, I suppose every game needs goals to make it really exciting, but as nil the draws go, I thought it wasn't a bad game. Um, I think we, we created some chances. They're a good side, they're well organised, they're disciplined, got good players, and they're hard to break down. Um, and we've been playing quite well, and I think we did play well tonight. Um, what was pleasing was keeping another clean sheet, um, four in six now, and it was something that we, we discussed um, cool. going back probably before the first one uh, where was it Sutton Common Rovers and so we, we talked about it and having a mentality and I think it looks like we've got that now which is which is great to see yeah obviously you say there it's kind of been consistently solid rather than kind of sporadically so just talk us through kind of how important that is going obviously into the next few weeks well we've got to get points on the board you know, it's not now about it. it's not about um, how well we play and how many passes we make and how amazing our goals are. It's points on the board that are, that are most critical now. Um, and we've played one of the best teams in the league. We've kept a clean sheet and we've got a point. So it's hard to be disappointed. You do sometimes look and think, yeah, we've had chances and could we have had a little bit more quality from getting the balls into dangerous areas? Um, but it's it's hard to when the, put, the players have put that much effort in. It's hard to then criticise. So I thought it was a good performance. Um, disciplined, uh, we didn't make any mistakes, any major mistakes and, and we caused them a lot of problems. Yeah, so obviously you say there's kind of four games left, uh, just talk us through the bank holiday weekend. Um, Huxbridge on Saturday who um, did really well against us here and, and we literally threw everything at them and got a couple of goals late on. Um, I've seen them a couple of times, they've got some decent players. Um, I think they're down there, but I, I, I well not down there, but I think they're mid-table and it's a um, it's a difficult place to go. Um, I don't think we'll, we'll be approaching that with any kind of, OK, this is an easy one. Um, we need to get those three points and then, then we'll start to look at Marlow. Um, you know, we've got reports on both and we've got an understanding of how, how both play and you, you kind of you start to look at who's available and um, there's a lot that goes into the kind of the planning of it. They look like you know, Marlow are a good side um, and it's something that we've got to approach with the same kind of resilience and, and mentality. I think at this stage of the season it's not about fitness or ability, it's about your, your mental strength um, and can you keep delivering at, the, at a high level for over long periods.